Hey everyone, today's how to install is an immersion transmitter with a GoPro to a Phantom 2 for first person view with a monitor on your remote. You're going to start off by taking the cover off your Phantom 2 and removing the cam wires that are right next to the Zenmuse wires on your Phantom 2. Once you've removed those wires, you're going to grab your immersion transmitter power cord and you're going to cut the end off of it. Then you are going to split the cam cord that was in your Phantom and take the red and brown wires and split those. Once you've spliced both those wires, you're going to then solder the red to the red and the black to the brown. If using a Chinese gimbal, you'll need to purchase a micro USB first person view adapter for your GoPro, which then will connect into your immersion transmitter. This is a plug and play cord. After connecting the micro USB, place the GoPro back on the gimbal and tighten. I bundled up the wires here and used zip ties to keep them out of the way. Now grab your immersion transmitter and take the power cord which you soldered earlier and plug it into the transmitter. Then take your plug and play micro USB from the GoPro and plug that into the transmitter. I use Velcro to attach the transmitter to the bottom of the Phantom. The cam wire that you took out at the beginning you'll want to push back up through one of the arms of the Phantom and plug back into the slot in which you took it out next to the Zenmuse. Once you've done this, power on the Phantom, power on your monitor, and turn on the GoPro. You should now see a live picture of what the GoPro is seeing. You can use the pitch lever on the back of the remote to turn the camera up and down, and you'll see that the camera will film where it's moving. Now that you see it's working, just make sure you tidy up all the wires on the bottom of the Phantom. You can do so with zip ties. Then place the top of the Phantom back on, but remember to insert the GPS wire back into the slot in which it was removed when you took off. Then flip the Phantom over and retighten with all the screws. Now power up your Phantom and fly and see in real time. Please like and or subscribe if you enjoyed. Thank you.